up, YouTube? This is Just Red Three back again with another video. We have a Rise of the Duelist booster box to open up, um, so let's jump right into it. The set is still pretty new. We're shooting this uh, pretty much right when it uh, releases. Uh, Vico was able to get some really good pulls out of our box battle. Uh, hopefully, you checked that video out. If you didn't, please check it out. And you can see me pretty much get totally destroyed in a box battle. But uh, let me just give me a second. Let me open up this box. All right, so hopefully I can redeem myself with this video and pull something really cool. That would be awesome. I'm, hope, uh, I'm looking to pull uh, a Forbidden Droplet. That card is really cool. Hopefully I can pull um, pull it. So, let's first pack. Let's see what we can get. We have a... Oh, I'm trying to get that angle. There we go. An uh, Infer Noble Knight Magius. A Dark Lord Nergal. A Melfi Mommy, a Dog Na uh, Dogmatica Nation, a Super Rare DD Dog, a Infernoble Knight Arms. Yeah, I can't pronounce that last one. A Machina Re Savenger, Infernoble Knight Ostel Folo, and an Infernoble Knight Captain Roland. Alright, Super Rare out of the first pack. Second. Yo, how come it always goes blurry whenever I move, like anything? No, it's fine. It's, I, I, I made it that way so the car, when you when you put up the cards, you're good. Yeah. Okay, alright. Just uh, make sure the cards are in the same spot. There you go. Alright, I have a Dice Die. A Melfi Fanny. A Thunder Hand. A Dark Lord Nergal. A Nemesis Keystone, super rare. That's cool. A DD Evil. A Melfi Hide and Seek, an Ancient Warrior Saga, uh, East by South Winds, and an Edge Imp Scythe. Super rare out of the next pack. Let's go in this one. It's an energy in this one. Okay. All right, next pack we have a Melfi Fenny, a Thunder Hand, a Dark Lord Nergal. Uh, a Fury of Kairushin, uh, uh, Kai Ryushin, and a Super Rare Guy the Fierce Knight Origin. Artwork on this card is awesome. Nice. Alright, I have a Performer Pal Card Gardener, a Machina Re Savinger, a Junk Sleep, and a Dogmatica Punishment. Dogmatica is the new archetype in this set. I heard it's really, really good. So, uh, looking forward to see what they can do in the current metagame. Even though there's not much tournaments going on right now. Looking forward to see what they can do on some online dueling. Alright, we have a... Oh, a little blurry. There you go. We have an unauthorized uh, boot-up device. A Melfi Tag. A Fury of Kairu Shin. A Dogmatica Nation. And a oh, Super Rare Blizzard. A Performer Pal Card Gardener. Machina Re Savinger, Junk Sleep, Dogmatica, Punishment for the last card. So all super rare so far, no ultras yet, but that's all right. They just might be hiding a little deeper down there. Jump into the next pack. Oh, we have a Linker Bell, probably my favorite card in the whole set. Infernoble Knight Magius, a Melfi Fenny, a Fluffle Dolphin. Oh, another super rare performer pal, Odd Eyes Metal Claw. That's cool. A Ritual Megalith Fool, Melfi Rabby, Super Heavy Samurai Scarecrow, and a Fright for a Jar. Alright, let's go with this pack. Gonna be a little random with the packs. Save all the, uh, Amazing cards for last. I have a DD Arc, Dracoon Lamp, Spiral Reborn, Melfi Fenny, and an Infernoble Knight Arms, Infernoble Arms uh, Joy Use, DD Evil, Super Heavy Weights, uh, Super Heavy Samurai Scarecrow, Melfi Rabby, and an Infernoble Knight Astol Foe. Just super rare so far. Go with this pack. Boom, we have a Fright for Repair, 
Unauthorized Boot Up Device, Dark Lord Uprising, Dogmatica Nexus, and a Super Rare Soldier Gaia the Fierce Knight. Again, another card with a really cool artwork. We have a Red Poton, Edge Imp Scythe, Dark Driver Vespinado, and a Megalith Fool. Our Ultras and Secrets don't want to show themselves yet. Let's see what this pack. Boom, we have a, oh, let's get that to focus, a Carpicius Dark Lord, Abyss Actor Twinkle Little Star, Melfi Playhouse, a Melfi Mommy, and a Ultra Rare uh, Infer Noble Knight Emperor Charles for our first Ultra Rare. I have a Junk Sleep, Red Poton. Performer Pal card Gardner and a heavy Heavenly Dragon Circle. First Ultra Rare of the box. I have a another Caprice Dark Lord, Melfi Playhouse, Linker Bell, Unauthorized Boot Up Device, and a Super Rare Red. Red Time Reviver Emitter. DD Evil, Super Heavy Raid Samurai, Melfi Rabi, and an Inferno Blink. That card is, uh, again, a palindrome. You can say it the same regardless of which direction you're reading it. Next pack. Let's get another Ultra Rare. There we go. Melfi Tag, Spiral Reborn, oh, and a Melfi Caddy, super rare. Galloping Gaia, that's a cool card. Oh, and, an, oh, and a secret rare, triple tactics talent. That's what I wanted to see. Oh, that card. Yes, there it card. is. Triple Tactics Talent Secret I Rare. I sent, I, sent, I sent this one in chat. That's one of the best secret shares. Probably the best secret, uh, secret rare to get I'm glad you in this got set. What you wanted. Spiral Fusion. That was Vico. He doesn't matter. You don't got to listen to him. Yeah, it's a pot of greed. Change of heart. <laughs> pot of greed. Change of heart. And so, the, Dog Medica uh, Esselestia, the Virtuous, currently stands at $750. For this one. Get out of my video. <laughs> Don't ask to hear your voice in this video. They love me. Oh man, this is a nice card. Though. I like this card. I do. I actually want. I'm about to take it. All right, next pack. Uh, let's repeat our luck with that secret rare. Let's get the forbidden droplet. Can we get the triple tactics and the? Oh, we got an ultra rare Quaki Meru supplier. Can we get the triple tactics and the forbidden droplet in one box? That would be amazing. What do you do? What is that we card can do Ooh, it. Currently, Triple Tactics Talent stands at $80. Nice. All right, we have a Fury of Kairu Shin. And a... Oh, Super Rare. The Deep Sea City. Mage... Major Lancia. Major Lancia? Sounds cool. I would go visit. There we go. Get the camera to focus. And the next pack has a... Oh, a super rare Raging Smash Tank Rhino Saber. Rampaging Smash Tank. Sorry about that. Rico, what are the, some of the good uh, ultra rares to pull from this pack? Ultra rare wise, you're looking at Dogmatica Celestia the Virtuous. Which is the highest price ultra at fifteen dollars. After that, it's Infer Noble Arms Durandal, which is ten bucks. Then Infer no Noble Knight Emperor Charles, which is seven dollars. Well, I got my ultra right here, oh. and it is. Oh, let me see if I can read that. Selgari, the Luminous Lunar Star, ultra rare. The um, artwork's amazing. I don't see that on here right now. It's just too cool to be listed up right now. That's all it is. <laughs> Most likely, it's all over the place when I'm 
Checking for um, mains and prices. So we're three ultras in one secret rare. Can I get a prismatic in place of my second secret? Can I get a forbidden droplet in place of, well, as my second secret? Let's see if we can pull dice, dice. It's an Xyz and it's a, oh, R Rika Queen Stenning, ultra rare. Stenna. Rika Queen Stenna, ultra rare. Rika Queen Strena stands at two dollars and sixty cents. Fantastic. <laughs> hey, it's a generic level four. Those cards are always good to have. That's true. All right. Yeah. So and I'm looking for my last good. secret rare. I have four ultra rares, one secret rare. Can we get it? Super rare Melfi Puppy. Uh, apologize for the blurriness, guys. Melfi tag. And it's a trap card. Oh, redeemable jar. Super rare. Get four packs for um, who it is? Right. One, two, three, oh, five. four, six. five, six packs left. Can I pull a prismatic or a forbidden droplet? That would be awesome. Spiral Reborn, Fluffle Dolphin, and a, oh, the first Dark Lord Super Rare. Curse of Dragon, the Cursed Dragon. Oh, it's a, oh. Oh, Majilisa, uh, Majel Lancia, the Deep Sea City. Another super rare. So, the first Dark Lord is first effect. If this card is season summon using Dark Lord Morningstar. As a material, you can destroy all cards your opponent controls. Fantastic. The, the first Dark Lord. Linker Bell. Such a good card. Except it requires three Dark Fairy monsters. Oh, there's my secret. It is a Chaos Ruler, the Chaotic Metal Dragon. Uh, Magical Dragon. His second secret stands as $15. Not bad, not bad. That's great. He technically made back his money for the bot. Which is what we all hope for in your pulls too, guys. Well, can I get three Angel. secrets? Can I get three secrets, maybe two ultra? Oh, super rare. Guy of the Magical Knight. I think I've done it twice where I actually did get two secrets and a prismatic, but it's a slim chance. Performer Pal, Odd Eyes, Metal Claw. And the last pack of Destiny. What can we get from this pack? Thunderhand. And it is a... Oh, it's a super rare uh, Nemphis Keystone from the last pack. All right, guys. We'll be back with a quick recap of our pulls. Go. All right, guys. I'm back with a quick recap. My first ultra rare is Kwaki Meru Supplier. Second ultra rare, I have... Uh, oh, I forgot his name. A Seliglare, the Luminous Lunar Dragon. Third Ultra Rare, Infernoble Knight Emperor Charles. And my last Ultra Rare was a Rika Queen Strena. My first Secret Rare was a Chaos Ruler, the Chaotic Magical Dragon. And the best card of the box was Triple Tactics Talent, Secret Rare. Definitely the best Secret Rare that's non-prismatic in this set. All right, guys, it's Justin Red 3. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell to see more videos, and we will see you in that next video. This is Justin Red 3, and we are out.